There's a new TSB controversy. Did Santino actually scam players again? So if you've been living under a rock, here's what happened. TSB, or the strongest battlegrounds, bribed a lot of people for the RDC voting. Santino made a promise to everyone. If TSB won the People's Choice Award, the character KJ would be free for everyone. Back to the story Roblox didn't like this and some serious allegations of rigging began to come along. Will TSB lose because it bribed voters? Or will it lose because Roblox rigged it? Continuing the story in Discord chats and forums, players were questioning how TSB even won the strategy award in the first place when it's primarily a fighting game. And how did TSB win best fighting but still lose the people's choice? There were accusations of bribing voters who did it all for KJ. It backfired when Roblox took notice and disqualified TSB from the award altogether. Shouldn't developers focus on winning through quality and people's perspective? Many argue that despite TSB's massive player base, they should have aimed for a win based on just the game itself, not temporary KJ. Roblox awarded the people's choice. And the winner is... Gunfight Arena! Gunfight Arena. So, what do you all think? Did Santino scam the community, or is TSB just winning by KJ? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell for more updates on everything happening.